Obituary A biographical sketch of a local personality. The whole community has been saddened by the news of the death of Brian Peterson, who died suddenly last week after a short illness. Brian was well known to many of us in the town, but he was particularly well known in climbing circles and was regarded locally as the grand old man of rock climbing. As a young man, he took part in several major and indeed dangerous climbing expeditions and cheated death on more than one occasion. He regarded it as a real feather in his cap that he was asked to take part in an Everest expedition in 1976 and welcomed the opportunity with open arms. The expedition was one of the major achievements of his climbing career and provided him with many anecdotes to which we all listened spellbound. A photograph of the expedition had pride of place on his mantelpiece. Brian will also be remembered as a wonderful speaker and writer. He wrote many articles on climbing for a wide range of publications, but sadly never got round to writing any books on the subject, although this was always his intention. This is a great loss, as he was both an informative and an entertaining writer. However, who can blame him for wanting to spend time on the hills rather than spend it behind a typewriter? Brian was a gifted writer, but it was as a speaker that he really came into his own. Whatever the nature of the audience, he made the subject of climbing come alive for them, illustrating his talks not only with marvellous slides, but also with personal anecdotes. He could hold any audience in the palm of his hand. Sometimes they would be on the edge of their seats at his stories, and sometimes they would be rolling in the aisles. Not surprisingly, he was never short of speaking engagements. Brian was an extremely active member of the local mountain rescue team until his illness. Although always willing to give a helping hand to people who got into difficulties in the mountains, he often got extremely angry with people who ventured onto the mountains without appropriate clothing or equipment and without leaving exact details of where they were going. Brian was a devoted family man and is survived by his wife, Susan, and his sons, Michael and Graham, both of whom are experienced climbers and members of the mountain rescue team. We extend our sympathy to them.